Good morning, my name is Joan Selecki. I'm an instructor that works for the City of Tempe Parks and Recs. We are here in front of beautiful Kiwanis Recreational Center this morning, and I hope you're having a good one. We're going to be working with the sit and fit. The first component is going to be the warm up. It's very important that when we exercise, that we warm up, get our core temperature, rising a little bit, get our body ready, warmed up for exercises to come. And the sit and fit, we're going to be working with the chair and then we're going to be doing some standing work later on. But when we are seated, we want to be seated on our sit bones. If you like, you can sit back and have a little more support to your back. But as you come more forward, it then calls upon your core to do a little more work because you don't have the back of the chair to help support you. So more of you is doing the support, which is a really good thing. But if you ever come forward and need that little extra support later on, you know you've got the back of the chair to work with. So we're sitting tall on our sit bones abdominal muscle engaged, our shoulders are down and back. I'm gonna have my joints in my lower body at 90 degrees because at 90 degrees, they're at the best and most stable. We're gonna first start warming up our lower body. We're gonna start with our left leg first. We're just going to do a very basic lift and lower and we'll do eight. And let's begin, eight, we're breathing as we exercise and as we move. Just going to where you feel comfortable. Remember, this is a warm up. And let's do one more. We're going to continue with the left leg. We're going to tap out and tap in. Lifting and lowering, we worked, warmed up the quad, a little into the hip flexor and hamstring because it's keeping the knee 90 degrees. We're going to warm that up in a little bit too, but now abduction, adduction, inner and outer thighs. Let's take it out and in for eight. Eight, seven, continuing to sit nice and tall. Five, in four, three, two, and one, reassessing our seated position. Let's take it over to our right leg. Let's lift and lower first for eight. Eight, seven, six, you're breathing. Five, a nice, a nice little tip for breathing. Three, two, and one. Now let's tap out and tap in for eight. Is count just a quiet count. Six, five. So when you quietly count, it forces you to breathe. Three, two, and one. Reassessing our seated position. Now we're going to march in place, starting with the left leg, and we're going to alternate the legs. Just lifting, lowering, lifting, and lowering. Let's do 12, 12, 11, 10, 8. Let's do four more. Three, two, one. We started on our left side. Now we got to start on our right side. We always want to do both sides and begin. 12, 9, keeping that abdominal muscle, 2, and 1 more. Let's take both legs, let's extend them out, keeping the knee soft, let's just pedal, just giving it a little bit of a stretch before we continue. Now let's bring both feet back up on 
if you're in the if you're in your house on the floor in the pavement now I'd like you to sit just a little bit more forward we're gonna work a little more into the hamstring think of the under under part of your seat we're gonna take a, our heel we'll start with our left leg and bring the heel to toward the under part of the seat and lower a little more into a warming up into our hamstring let's do eight eight seven six five you can bring the foot down if you'd like like i'm doing now or you can keep the leg lifted your choice three two and one now before to our right leg let's extend our left leg out rest it on the heel once again let's extend our left arm keeping our body tall from our hip let's just hinge forward a little more stretch through the back of the leg the hamstring right here and now let's sit up we're not holding the stretches long let's bring the leg in body's not ready for that flexibility work yet let's go over to our right leg and let's take our heel to the under part of the chair for eight eight seven we're continuing to sit tall in four three two and one let's take our right leg now extend it out extend our right arm we're continuing to sit tall and from the hip we're hinging forward and as always breathing that'll be a cue you'll hear me say constantly because people I'm giving you a lot of things to do let's sit up and people will say you want me to breathe too yeah it's important so helping you along with that with the cueing sitting tall warmed up our lower body now let's do some warming up of our upper body taking our right arm we're going to start with the right side now let's extend the arm down let's keep the hand open and it's the hand is nice and relaxed we're only going to come up shoulder level to the front and we're going to lift and lower for eight eight seven six five four and one now let's take our right hand place it on our right thigh let's extend our left arm and lift for eight starting to warm up not only the arms but more into that shoulder girdle which is working three more and one now we're going to take both arms we're going to lift them up shoulder level and we're going to bend at the elbows flex at the elbows 90 degrees keeping the arms up if you need to lower a little that's fine but remembering that we want to keep those shoulders down and back and we're going to extend them out in front of us and bring them back to 90 degrees for eight eight warming up a little more into the chest and into the front of the shoulders six five four three two and one now let's take it in reverse we're going to extend both arms turn the palms to face each other and we're going to pull back and squeeze the shoulder blades together once again if you need the elbows down that's fine if you need to bring the arms down a little bit that's fine and let's begin for eight seven six five 
four, three, two, and one. Let's bring the arms down, place the hands on top of the thighs, and one of my favorite things to do, let's roll those shoulders. And now let's take it in reverse. I want to keep those shoulders loose. They're meant to move, but they're also meant to stabilize. But we want them nice and loose to be able to do that as well. So we can place them back down and back. And now let's take a nice breath in. And as we exhale, let's look over our left shoulder, just stretching into our neck a little bit. Inhale, let's bring our head to center. Exhale, let's look over our right shoulder. Inhale, head to center. Exhale, let's look up. I'm looking at a beautiful blue sky with some trees. Inhale, let's bring our head down. Exhale, let's bring our chin down. Inhale, lift, exhale, let's tilt our head over to the right. Inhale, let's bring our head to center. Exhale, tilt over to the left. Inhale, let's come to center and exhale. Now, let's lift our sternum, let's lift our chin. Not too high. Not a big, big, big move, but we want to lift it a little so we can give our front of our shoulders and our chest a stretch. We're going to squeeze our shoulder blades again, once again, squeezing, it has a tendency to get a little tight when we sit because sometimes when we sit too long, we start to slouch. So we want to open up the chest. And let's sit up nice and tall, bringing our shoulders down and back. Let's bring our arms up in front of us, palms facing each other. Now you can either clasp your fingers, my arms are up and extended, or stack your hands. Let's reverse, there's the clasping of the fingers, there's the stacking of the hands. And let's gently push forward, giving our upper back a stretch. And now we're going to release the hands as we bring the arms down. We're going to hinge toward our thighs, bringing our upper body on our thighs and then just letting the arms release. All of this doing it up to your pace and your comfort. And now coming up one vertebrae at a time, it's a great way Put yourself back in neutral alignment, hands on the thighs, shoulders down and back, sitting tall. Take a nice breath in and exhale. We've completed the warm up. I hope you join me for the next segment, but have a safe and a very well day and a very great day. Thank you all for joining me.